Yo. Yo, 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 yo. So, we are now here live with a State of the K update. And I honestly want to talk about it. Let's, so, let's talk about I didn't even go over it yet. I just literally loaded up the game once I saw that there was a, a lo- an update on it. So, apparently, and I ain't gonna lie, we we going we gonna go over this together. We we is we, we we gonna go over it together. So, apparently, what's going on in this update? Hold on, I have to literally plug some stuff in. Uh, I'm not gonna hold y'all. I gotta plug some stuff in real quick though. So look. I mean, and what's going on ain't, I guess it's not bad. I guess it's just stuff that people were complaining about because I'm not going to lie to y'all. I was also complaining too. And if you watched my last stream, I was talking about one of the things I complained about was how come we cannot drop our rucksacks at our outposts. And that was one of my biggest issues that I was having with the game was not being able to um, drop your, your stuff at your outposts. But apparently we, we got some stuff going on. So let's see a collection of quality of life improvements. With today's update, we are addressing a few issues which have been affecting players while also implementing improvements. Here's what we have included. Quality life improvements and tweaks. You now have the ability to drop your rucksack at upgrade outpost level two or higher. Thank you. Big ass round of applause. To, to Undead Labs in the develop team. Alright, cause we, <laughs> I, I was literally mad that I had to keep driving all the way to my base to drop a rucksack, bro. That is ridiculous. There is now a take all action for containers for the survivors that need to grab everything and run. Okay, not bad, not bad. I like it. There is now a drop item action directly from containers, making it easy to shuffle and transfer personal items around. This action has also been added to vehicle store. Damn, was they watching my stream? <laughs> Were they watching my stream or what? Like, yeah, Lee, like, they straight up addressing these things. And I ain't gonna lie, like, I ain't got no problem with it. Like, if you're going to address it, address it. Like, I'm down for it. You know, you can remove weapon attachments from selected range weapons in a supply locker without needing to equip them first. Again, that ain't bad. Like, y'all not hearing me? Listen, I'm not complaining. <clears throat> I mean, I never really had a, a problem with that. At least I don't think I had a problem with that. I don't know. Maybe somebody else probably had a problem with it. But I most definitely didn't. So again, I can't really say anything. I can't really complain. The zombie trappers in the cannibals enclave enclaves can now appear once per map instead of once per community. I don't I have no idea what they're talking about with that one. I am gonna lie to you. I have no idea what they're talking about. Minor bloater improvements. The and damage of the gas bursts are better matched, so it no longer looks and feels like you are damaged unfairly. To compensate, the bloaters will now also try to get slightly closer to your survivor before exploding. Again, I never had a problem with that. That must be like people that are new to the game that must be having problems with it. Better completion counter on curveballs with objectives under the weather and missing a few bolts would now read zero and three deposit instead of one or three times again um i'm not having any issues with that again that must be new people or people who just complaining that it's not going their way a minor change that allows more characters to potentially get the blood plague survivor trait okay i don't have a problem with that expansion of he, the reason i don't have a problem with that because I, I like a new challenge so i don't have a problem with that expansions of new randomly generated character names and nicknames added to the pool when creating a new survivor i'm gonna have to check that out and black hurt curveball tweaks bro have they been watching my stream was they watching my stream yesterday 
that almost six hour stream that I was having going on, it's been mentioned that the black heart can be too dominating on a community, especially when it rolls early. So we made some adjustments to make it feel more balanced and less punishing. The black heart curveball will not only appear after six days have passed or two when, bro, hey, undead laughs. I'm not gonna lie. I'm not a big streamer. I'm not a big YouTuber. But my thing is, was you was you guys watching my stream yesterday? Like, cause I ain't gonna. I was frustrated yesterday that I just started this community, and I had to deal with a plague heart. I believe on day one, but I took care of it on day two because of the whole them causing infestations and everything with it. Like, bro, y'all had to be watching my stream. The black heart, toxic, whatever effect will stop dealing damage sooner at a higher health threshold rather than right down to a slither of health remaining damage per tick stays the same damage vo added when taking toxic damage to give additional warning while also feeling more realistic improve vfx for black heart plague you know whatever that whatever whatever shut up reduce the fuel drain speed for the black heart thick oh yeah yeah that needs to be reduced bro i'm not gonna lie because when i went to go take care of it i had like a full tank and that thing just went to e so quick bro so quick reduce the growth speed for the black heart growing dominant the dominion effect balancing changes to the fire resistant black heart zombie slower and cause less sickness plague okay okay so they took Bro, y'all had to be watching my stream. I don't care what nobody. I don't. <laughs> y'all had to be watching my stream, bro. Because you know when I uh, when I look back at my um, my views after the stream, I, I do have some views on there. After the stream, I do have some views. Surprisingly enough, I do have some. And bug fixes, Trumbo Valley, Cleo mission, eggs edge case fix previously it was possible to end the mission without getting the cleo device and then be sub subsequently unable to man i'm slurring my words y'all gotta excuse me i just got off of work and i just see this fix for a crash when attempting to access cash community after shutdown okay y'all do need to fix some crashes though i'm not gonna lie i had to delete my whole community bro I had to delete my whole community because every time I was trying to do a mission, bro, and I had to drop all the way up the map on Trumbull Valley, my mine will crash. I had to make a whole nother community because of it, bro. Sentinel mutation curveball and the hyper auditory mutation curveball can no longer roll at the same time. It was an awkward combination as they contracted each other minor curveball journal improvement fix ui clipping and slight adjustment to automatic okay so they fixed some issues but how ironic is that on my last stream i was literally suffering well not suffering that's a i'm not going to say that but i was dealing with so much campaign and i i'm just like game. bro manage community continue especially game. with the play like the black heart bro like i'm on day two and i get a black plague heart going on on my stream which was crazy like i was so aggravated and annoyed with that black plague heart causing infestations and i'm like dog this can't be serious now I will say this, my mic was muted, bro. And I did not know this. My mic was muted. A supporter of my stream joined my game. And I was ended up saying what's up to him, but I, I guess he wasn't him. Then I kind of noticed when I looked up at my party chat and I saw that my name wasn't popping up. And I was like, oh crap, I was mute. Bro, I was aggravated that whole time dealing with that Black Plague card. And then the crashes and everything that's been going on to the point where I had to delete my community, bro, and start a whole, and you know what I'm saying? Bro, I was aggravated because I didn't want to have to delete my uh, my community. We need to talk. But unfortunately, I had to delete my community, bro, which 
really like bro when i say i was so so aggravated bro i was genuinely genuinely aggravated probably more than you guys thought i was like aggravated because i'm trying not to get mad on stream for you guys but i could not How fun. hold that, that in bro like i was genuinely genuinely like annoyed bro but now i'm happy to see that um they they did fix some changes so i i can't be mad they fixed some changes and i'm i'm happy about some of the changes that are being made hmm. because now if you are new to the state of the k you don't have to Thank deal you. with the uh the black plague heart i need to kill five armor zeds in close combat that's all i gotta work with but for now that's all i got to say in this video and i will talk to you all later